Well, I've been putting in for 15 to 20 years uh, for a goat tag in Montana. And, uh, you know, you, you're playing the lottery. You never know when you're going to get a tag. You just hope you get one when you still have a body to do it. The biggest challenge is the terrain. That makes goat hunting arguably the most difficult hunt in the lower 48. If you've got fear of heights, goat hunting's maybe not for you. The steepness of the mountains themselves make them unique, and the miles and miles of endless scree. And to try and hike across that stuff all day long really is a test of your body to find out what your, what your ankles and legs and, and uh, the rest of your body can endure. And just make sure that you keep your head on your shoulders and make good decisions when you're climbing around because, you know, one false step could, could mean your life. I think I honestly could have come out of there without a goat and had a successful hunt. We saw goats, we were close to goats, and that in itself is something. The fact that we harvested a, a mature billy, yeah, that was icing on the cake. I think the biggest thrill is just saying, okay, I did that. And maybe as you get older, you, you're looking for challenges like that to prove that yeah, I can still do it. I can still do it. That was one of the most difficult hunts I've ever been on, by far, by far. There's an old adage that there's not many repeat goat hunters, you know, and it's very true. I have no desire to do that again. <laughs>